Hello, we are here with Christian, the director of Ligna. Good morning, Christian. How are you? Hi, Apertim. I'm very good. Thank you very much. I'm really lucky I got you free sometimes today. Like most of the times you are busy and like Ligna is coming in, in next year. That's the biggest thing in the woodworking industry. We all are, you know, waiting for that. What, what sets Ligna apart from other competing fairs? Well, Ligna is, is the show where all the woodworking manufacturers machinery manufacturers, uh, tool manufacturers, plant manufacturers show their innovations in a biannual cycle and um, Ligna is uh, larger than the five following shows summed up when it comes to size and the um, most important thing about Ligna is that we cover the whole the whole cycle of woodworking. We start with forestry go up to sawmill technology, wood-based panel production, and the whole secondary industry is present at Ligna. And that's, that's very important for the show, and that makes the DNA of Ligna. And this is what draws more than 90,000 people every year to Hanover to see what's up at uh, woodworking and wood processing in the world. Great. How, how is 2017 show shaping up? What innovations can visitors look forward to it? Well, again, we can we can look forward to uh, yeah, all the movements regarding network production, uh, regarding automation, regarding new things about uh, sawmill technology. So all the manufacturers, all the companies, all the exhibitors will show their innovations at Ligna again in 2017 in May in Hanover. Great. How has been the response in to integrated manufacturing at the Ligna conference? We had huge response because um, we started at uh, Ligna 2015 with this topic for the industry and um, we developed it further with the conference and it was very well received. We had keynote speakers from IKEA, from Wirt here in Germany and uh, Volkswagen for example, just to name a few. But the whole industry was there. We had a great panel of people discussing. We had HOMAC, SGM, Biesa, and all the huge companies discussing what will move them for the next couple of years. And that was amazing. And we're looking forward to continue those discussions and to actually see what will be the solutions on that during Ligna in uh, Hanover next year. Great. Christian, as we know, like robots and drones will have major spotlights at the upcoming Ligna. Uh, what, what will Ligna 2007 deliver to foster uh, R&D in innovation? Well, we have, uh, yeah, of course, a lot of uh, artificial intelligence coming into our business from primary to secondary industry, especially for the primary industry and forestry technology drones will, yeah, open up new horizons when it comes to analyze uh, yeah, forests and to um, observe the, the harvest. And um, that will be shown by a special display hosted by the uh, German Forestry Council, the KWF. And um, when it comes to robots, when it comes to automation, we actually have a very new display area called uh, Automation Technology. and. Um, and drives and everything what uh, what is very important robots for the automation industry within woodworking in hall 16 it's a very new display category we open up um, and um, yeah we're looking forward to um, yeah to really welcome all the new exhibitors but we already had a lot of exhibitors for example Siemens Beckhoff BNR all those companies were at Ligna for many many years and we are clustering them together and um, yeah, the industry uh, really can see what ventures um, are out there. Great. Since you mentioned about a new hall and new display, tell me about the preparation of all new thematic display of forestry technology in this respect. Uh, how, how has been the collaboration with German Forestry Council? For many years we're working together with the German Forestry Council mm -hmm. when it comes to hot topics, new trend topics and uh, yeah, the innovations in forestry technology and primary in, in the primary industry and um, also with the German Forestry Council we are organizing for example a new live 
show area on the outside, um, yeah, open air site. And uh, this is where we have companies showing their technology to the audiences. Live demonstration, how to cut the trees machine, with machinery help and um, how to, uh, yeah, get the logistics after the harvest right. And this is what we will show on the open air site in action. That's new to Ligna. Um, and also the Wood Industry Summit will show and host many interesting people and technologies in Hall 26, right in the middle of the wood-based panel production. So yeah, we're really looking forward to this new international ventures, but also to this live demonstration areas we will host on the open air side. Oh, great. Before I move to my next question, can you can you explain me? Because I heard I heard something new from a few of our advertisers who are, of course, a very big exhibitor of yours, of Ligna, about the new development, about the, the design of the hall, new design, and they have moved to different halls. And can, can you explain some, something about that? Yes, of course. We realized together with the exhibitors about two years ago that in woodworking industry, you cannot divide between, technology-wise, divide between a smaller shop, smaller shop and an industrial manufacturing site anymore, because there are many small shops who invest in very high-end technology, and the borders are actually, yeah, not very sharp anymore. And um, also, the furniture industry is trying to individualize their products on a very high level. And this is why we realized we need to change Ligna towards an international, very sophisticated audience and don't differ between small or large shops, but show interesting technology and actually put this on the menu for Ligna 2017. On top of that, we decided to open up a new area, which was part of the furniture industry in the past called surface technology and um, it will be in Hall 17. It's a huge area with companies like Scheffler, Barbaran, Berkler and we are yeah, really proud to uh, say that this area is growing very fast right now and it's yeah actually very interesting to to see how individualization of products, especially when it comes to surfaces, is a, is a real hot topic. And uh, these were the reasons to uh, yeah, really change the face of Ligna a little. Many, many exhibitors will change their places. For example, HOMAC will be in Hall 14, Biesse in Hall 11, IMA in Hall 12, S SEM and Felder will be in Hall 13 and Weinig in Hall 27. So we'll have a nice circle within the secondary industry. You can walk and uh, see everything you want within a couple of halls, but see the surrounding technology as well. So it is all thought from a visitor point of view and it's very convenient for people traveling from abroad really Wanted, wanting to see innovation in woodworking technology. Right, I can understand this time, like as we are coming for many, many, many years, many editions of Ligna, this time first we have to study and see the changes of the hall positions numbers without just going to one hall and not getting our customer, like company there. Great, as we, as we visit different trade shows all over the world, worldwide, Still, I feel like Ligna has been always like surprisingly versatile. What about the participating of companies dealing with machining of plastics and composites? Well, the processing of plastic and composites is a topic for Ligna for many, many years. Um, we realized um, a couple of editions ago that there are companies who are actually focusing on showing those kind of machineries that are able to process these non-wooden materials and we are highlighting it since Ligna 2015 because we really feel that there's a completely new audience coming to Ligna to see these machineries. The woodworking machinery are usually very effective when it comes to processing plastic and composites, sometimes without 
even a change of the tooling system. And uh, this is very interesting for manufacturing companies coming out of automotive industry or interior building, interior designing um, from yeah, vessels, from airplanes, from cars. And um, this is why we are yeah, pursuing this, this topic for already two years now. And uh, we will continue doing that because the woodworking machinery are um, very versatile. And this is what we will put together for the next issue as well. Well, Christian, like when we plan for Ligna, we don't only plan for Ligna. It is always one trip, two fares, Ligna yes. and Interzoom, right? So what, how, how, how would it help the visitors, uh, this collaboration of your, this uh, one, one trip, two fares concept? Well, it makes perfect sense that Interzoom and Ligna are right next to each other. There's only a weekend right. splitting your trip and um, you can use this weekend for yeah. Either Hanover or Cologne. Yeah, I prefer Hanover, of course. Okay, of course. Um, yes. you, you, you stay there. Yes, exactly. That's your home. And uh, um, usually people start with Cologne, obviously, mm -hmm. uh, spend a couple of days there looking at uh, what Interzoom holds. But uh, yeah, at Ligna, they can see all the innovations about the machinery. And it makes sense, especially when you're traveling from abroad, coming mm -hmm. from Asia, South America, right. or the Americas in general, it's very convenient, it's very effective. You have a very short train drive between Cologne and Hanover and um, yeah, you will be hosted very uh, convenient. And it's just, yeah, it's one ticket, um, two fares, it's one trip, um, two fares and you are set for the next two years when it comes to all the innovations of woodworking industry. Great. As you as you mentioned, for the for the for the customer, for the visitors of uh, South America and America, uh, as we know, you have your show in Mexico in few months. Can you can you tell me something about that? Well, the Ligna brand does not travel, but Deutsche Messe as right, an organizer right. travels. Uh, when it comes to uh, Mexico, when it comes to Russia, when it comes to um, China and Russia, for example. And uh, in Mexico, you will have a very well set up show, which will be the 23rd edition already in Mexico City in January. And um, this show caters to furniture industry, caters to shops, of course, um, and of course, primary industry. This is where we will start, of course. And it's a co-hosted show. There will be furniture, there will be woodworking machinery, and it's Mexico City. And everyone in the industry knows there's a lot of reshoring coming from China towards North America and um, the industry in especially the United States um, mostly decides to manufacture the products in Mexico. This is why there's a huge potential. There's already a very huge knowledge and uh, we are happy to be there with our customers that we know very well from Ligna and uh, yeah, from our industry to yeah, help um, be a key player in the market when it comes to market their products to the industry. Do you plan for any new show in Asian market? Well, we are already a partner of Woodmac China and um, the Asian market is uh, very diverse. We also host uh, a, or no, we operate a uh, fairground in Indonesia as well as we do in Shanghai. So. We have already a very good network in China and in uh, Indonesia. So uh, we are analyzing the market very, very thoroughly. And um, yeah, I guess uh, you might see a footprint very soon in the Asian market. Okay. Do you have any message for a special message for uh, our readers like your, your visitors for Ligna 2017? You will be surprised about a new face of Ligna and uh, what I saw so far in the planning of our customers. There's a lot of new breathe to Ligna next year because everyone will define their market position new and um, they will redesign all their booths and um, it will be a great show. I'm very confident about that and what I see right now um, when I take a look at who's already um, on board, it will be a huge show. It will be 
the best um, for the next couple of months, this at least for 2017 and 2018 um, in the industry. All the innovations will be shown. And uh, if you come here to Hanover, you'll set for your market and the development of your business and industry. Thank you so much, Christian. We will eagerly wait for the, the biggest thing in the woodworking industry in a few months. Uh, wish you all good luck and best of luck for Ligna 2017. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you.